Welcome and welcome back everyone. It is good to be back. We're back with something different. We're back with Stranded Alien Dawn. But thanks for joining me on this first episode of this uh, early access survivalist survival game. Uh, and you know I love survival games in all manners and forms, so I'm looking forward to this one. Has been out for a little bit of time, but uh, decided to jump on it just because it looks absolutely awesome. Graphically, absolutely amazing. Uh, I have yet to watch much at all of it other than the launch video. I haven't watched any other YouTubers, so it's all quite fresh in my mind. I've done the tutorial. I went for a new game just to sort of see what I had to do to set up. But we're going to start with a brand new game. Um, but you can already see it looks pretty stunning. It looks like there's going to be a lot to it. And I always like well early access games that add a lot of content as it progresses because some obviously die out, dry out, burn out and just don't happen but I'm hoping this will. Uh, so let's get straight into it, not keep you a much a longer waiting. So crash landing, I know we can't change any of this, we're going to keep it on medium at the moment. If the music's too loud we'll play around with that later as well. Uh, what have we got? And these are your stocks, so we're going to get rid of all of these and start afresh. So you start with all these guys. You can pick who your first uh, survivalist will be. You get to pick four, and you can, you will get other survivalists that you'll find along the way, and you can take them on board uh, as you see fit. So uh, let's start at the bottom. I'm not going to go through all of them because I know who I have used in my test run just for the initial day and I might go them again but let's have a look I don't want to get anyone that's too unhappy uh, so obviously gloomy we don't like that uh, bloodlust gains happiness would kill in I don't mind that you know I don't mind that occasionally improves crafting skills so that could be good we'll put that in the shortlist Vivian uh, can't perform healing tasks no Vanessa can't fail medical treatments. That's good. Impeccable healer. Yep, like that one. Uh, increases manipulation for happiness while inside, which are decreased outside. No. Son of Vivian. Okay. 100% uh, recovers health twice as fast. 25 more movement speed manipulation. This is good. Gets oh, gets hungry. Hmm. Twin... Put them there for a moment. Uh, health recovers health twice as fast. Bleeding permanently decreased by five. Refuses to eat meat. Has chance to field observe unknown species. Ooh, that's pretty good. Has performed increase permanently increased happiness. I like that. Hmm. Construct structure device twice as fast as permanently decreased happiness. Has no. Personally increased, loves going on expeditions. Mm. Got two, three ladies. We need to see some of the guys. Cannot experience meltdowns. Will not fight. Nah, not going to work. Gains happiness when killing, finds twice as much scrap. Yep, nah, 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 this one. So we need to take out Yoko. The Ken. Now, I do know. Grayson, what's this? Grayson, his husband. Movement speed is decreased. Hmm. Does it get sad? Recovers health twice as fast. I don't want someone who's so slow. This could be it. Recovers health twice as fast. Speed of inflation gets hungry 25% quicker. That's fine. I can put up with that. 100% recovers health, 25 percent movement speed. No, don't like it. Occasional switches traits, no. Makes even simplest dishes taste exquisite as permanently increased happiness. Ooh. Good work. Good work. So we've got the healer. We've got someone who gets a lot of scrap. We don't really have a builder. Who builds well? Who builds well? Let's have a look who builds well. Does building fast really matter? I don't think it does. I want to go with these. What have we got? Well, we've still got three girls and a guy. It doesn't matter. Let's do that. 
let's head into it, but it's uh, super exciting. So having a bit of a dabble with the tutorial, uh, I, uh, graphically it looks really superb, uh, and the fundamentals, obviously it's, it's taken a lot out of other survivalist builders. You hear the people screaming. Can you hear the people screaming? Oh dear. Where do we where do we go? Wow. Oh, up on the hill. That's a pain. Alright, let's get to work. Let's get to work. Salvage. Someone's not very happy. You can cry all you want. Okay. Uh first of all. We need to start getting some shelter. We have That's right, we'll get plenty of uh, steel or metal in a moment. How many have we got? Four people. We need to get four beds, right? So, one, two, three. And that. And we need to get a fire. Let's get all this stuff. We can't do the fire yet. Okay. Because we need to go grab. So we'll go here. Cut. Let's cut all these trees down. Let's just cut all this down. Cut. Cut. Alright. Meet. Reader's having a meltdown. So pretty much, uh, with all the people, you've obviously got your, uh, your overview, how the happiness, uh, tolerances, so forth. Then you've got their general health. Uh, and then you've got their happiness. So you've got to give them entertainment. And then you have what they're wearing, clothes. So we've got to get them weapons pretty fast. And we've got their de their traits, which we can go through later. And obviously, if they're happy, what are they consuming? Then you can take control of them as well. So when we have combat and so forth. So what we need to get is science happening. So straight away, I've done this. So we're going to get a few things. We're going to start with you. Actually, science. Yes, we can't do that yet. That's because we've got no wood yet. Metal wood fine. Let's get uh, scrap metal. We should get enough of that. Storages. Let's just do that along there. Alright. So our why are they quickly building that up? Got them cutting down trees. Let's have a look around the area. So we've got lots of mushies. So that's good. Need mushies. I think that helps with the healing side I saw in the tutorial. We have got some crash ships close by. I think these guys, I haven't really encountered them yet. They might come and attack us. I don't know. These seem to be harmless, I think. Yeah, relatively peaceful. What about these? What did it say? Relatively peaceful. Okay, they are peaceful. So we need to start looking into researching. So first of all, we can go over here and observe. And we need to get these mushies. We need the mushies. Where are the closest mushies? Up here. Alright. Cool go down, so the closest mushies are here, go and observe you, done, let's speed up, alright, let's cut down some of you, that gives us some sticks, and that now means we can start getting what we wanted, which was our workbench. We'll keep that a metal bench. Oh, scavenged a gun, so that's what we want. We need to now get... They're basically going to select. And we can go to their goods, so we can go, give me a gun, please. There's two guns. We're going to give you a gun as well. So at least 
got some protection early on which is what we want oh I can cut those trees that have been smashed down there's no resources there's rocks which we can mine later stone sorry uh, okay so we've got plenty we don't actually have that much raw resources around they're a bit of a distance so that's those which we can research later got these at quite a distance aren't they and over here got the pointy red plant all right so we can come over here and we're gonna need to research and okay, get so observe you and we're gonna need food later so we're gonna observe you so we're trying to get the research table organized so we can start researching and we better come and scavenge you as well so this is the dude who's uh researching these orange mushrooms thank you so we can just go bang bang thank you so everyone's busy that's the important part that's what we want this early stage now looks like we're going to get our workbench happening which can't do too much with yet uh we can craft these but we don't have the facilities we need to unlock scavenge scrap cloth to unlock the recipe collect to unlock the recipe well meat all right come on blade grass so we did the blade grass so took a sample of blade grass and it uh, is hay so we got hay so we can go take some hay power cell nice so we'll have some power and now we're just going to go through here and we're going to say we don't want to harvest oh can't we harvest we can only cut all right tall grass observe need some of this anyway so Mark plants to be cut, cutting. I don't want to cut crops. I want it to grow back. It's like a jackhammer. And up the top, you can see we have some electronic components. We've got 56 food, 10 medical supplies, plenty of six, plenty of tree wood. But we'll go get another couple of... Oh, this would be good. Can we cut these? Bad boy. Okay. Cut you down and cut you down. New synthetic. We found a helmet. Just, uh... Look at this. This looks awesome. It's got the lake... We'll have to move down here later on. Ooh. Insect nest. It's going to be fun. Look at these bad boys. I don't want to get too close to you. All this cool stuff that's uh, scattered shipwreckage everywhere. Minerals down here. I hope we've got some near us. So very big map. Absolutely awesome. Oh. These bad boys. Small flying lizard. Oh, something's been attacked down here. Raw meat. Oh, what do we got here? Shiny rock. Damn, we don't have anything around us. We haven't landed in the best spot. What do we got here? Just stone. Uh oh. Alright, we can fix that up. We've got.
grab the metal there, build this table, and then we're all good. Yeah. Cool. So now I will uh, go over here and we're going to build another. Cool. And then we'll put some more storage. We're going to put storage shelves. And then we're going to put storage over here. Cool. So the reason I got storage underneath is just because it lasts longer. Technically, some of this thing like timber and that can be outside. Because uh, it's indefinite outside. So we could actually store all this outside. That's probably what we'll set up later. We'll have an outdoor storage. Oh, glitter cap. We got it. That's what we wanted. Uh, harvesting glitter caps. All right. Cool. So we need to go get some of those. Where was the glitter caps? Oh, uh, over here. So let's go harvest these if we can. Harvest. Not cut so they grow back. So we'll probably go for a day or two, and that'll be the first episode. How much metal scrap have we got? Not much. Problem is now, it's way, way, way over here. Oh, we can do our science. Sorry, we can do our research. Let's research first. Weapons. We need weapons. We'll need clothing. Uh... Fortification would be handy. Only needs timber. Construction and that would be good. There we go. It's sufficient store out because it's not built yet. Come on guys, you need to go to sleep. Let's go. I'll skip ahead for the sleep guys. You won't have to stick around. Wait for Vanessa to come to bed here. Come on. Notice I've given the gun to the guy that loves killing. <laughs> Ken. Emmeline, Ken, Rita, and Vanessa. Our first settlers. And their first night. Well, we got some of those mushies, so that means we should now be able to class the healing balm. So we'll go here, and we'll do until we'll always have 10, 5 in stock for now. And we can't craft anything else at the moment. All right, they're back awake again. So what I just did while they were sleeping was I've started to manufacture some healing balm. So I've kept it at five minutes at all times. That allows us to always have healing balm ready to rock and roll, uh, which is basically medicine. We've just discovered a grass harvesting grain. Uh, I will call it green grass. Green grass grows slowly but fries in most soils. Green. So we can now harvest that as well. Cool. Blade grass. We need to. Grain grass. There's a lot of grain grass around. We need someone who cooks. What are these? Here's something else. Berries? Wide leafed plants. Okay. New resource. We've got our first healing balm. Good stuff. There it is on the shelf. We'll sort all that out. Still upset about the resources. Oh, good. We're over here. There's absolutely no resources. 
in terms of uh, iron ore and all that sort of stuff. Where are you over here? Here we go. Here we go. What's over here? No. No. A lot of killing going on around here. Something came through here and killed a hell of a lot of animals. What was it? Hmm. It's scary. Something came through and killed a hell of a lot of animals. Ooh. Spaceship. Here we go. This could be good. How far is that from camp? That's not far. All right. But no raw resources. Ooh, we've got these evil. Flathead animal. Look at these bad boys. I love it. This is actually looking it's very the environment's beautifully created, that's for sure. But still no raw resources. Raw Rock, that's all we've got. 184, that is awesome. How's our research going? It's not, is it? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put everybody on research for now. I need more people researching. Plenty of fabric, uh, plenty of raw food. Plenty of meals, emergency rations. We'll have to make food, we'll have to get cooking going. Oh, good, Emmeline's reached a new height in her life. Uh, we need to get cooking. Uh, where is cooking farms? Oh, we didn't do the fire. We forgot this very early on. That's very bad of us. All right, we'll get this happening now. Uh, and furniture, we want to put some heat in for this one on this side. Uh, actually, we'll just do a fire on this side. Why not? I'll be a lot happier with the fire now. Use a cooking a quick meal. Looks like it is dinner time. That's cool, we've got the grains on the shelf. Researching. We're crafting, now we're crafting. No one's even started researching yet. Hopefully in the morning. Alright, you'll see me back. Hopefully they won't freeze to death on the second night. First camp, we put together a camp as quickly as we could. We are not sleeping in the dirt. We have a roof over our heads and a fire to illuminate. Well, we don't have the fire yet. We've survived. We can gather around the campfire. Yeah, let's celebrate. Tonight we're going to celebrate. Definitely. Oh, the fires are built now. That's cool.
Is there any way of prioritizing this? Use tea boiling. Nice. Where's this? Where are the tea leaves? Oh, Vanessa's got to go quite a distance. Now, they don't look like they're that harmful. So I did find an interesting rock. Up here. And that's probably going to be the closest rock that I can see. Oh, what's this one? That's not going to be how good. Everyone seems to be peaceful until you probably get killed by them. <laughs> Everything's dead. Look, another dead one. Come on. We need someone to start researching this. Walking in the rain is unpleasant, but sleeping soaking wet is outright horrible. Survivors out in the open will have decreased happiness. On the other hand, rain is great for the plants and boosts their growth. Uh, so we've got tea leaves. The smoke leaf plant might have another use if we boil the raw leaves. Uh, so we can get smoke leaf. Temperature tolerance. So we can now farm nose. The wide leaves of plants are remarkable, similar to the rare and expensive type of tobacco. Unlocks harvesting raw smoke leaf. All right, drying of smoke leaf into dry on a drying rack. Interesting. All right, so we can start building a few more things. Uh, what I do want to do is some, um, just in case we get attacked. How much? Play. Skin bark. Cool, we've got some skin bark. I'm just going to put a couple of traps around here. You never know. Who knows, we might move base later on. I don't know if that's right or wrong, but it just it looks good. Oh, veggie armor. Oh, there we go. Veggie armor. Interesting. Mental breakdown for Ken. Poor Ken. What does he need? He needs, he needs some happiness. You know what he needs? Yep, needs happiness. You know what you do with happiness? Campfire settings. Uh, used for cooking meals. Yep. 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 Quick recipes. Oh, we can do grain soup. Grain porridge. Nice. Veggie soup. Awesome. So let's, uh, always have four, ha yeah, four veggie soups. And let's have always... Um, veggie soup, we'll have four of those. Seems a nice variety. How long did they last for? One meal. Cool. Makes people happy. Alright, what else can we do with this? Veggie soup until we have five. Uh, or can we only do one at a time? Oh, we've got two veggie soups. Uh, okay, cancel that. Cool. Oh! This is Meltdown. You know what we need to do? We need some entertainment. Uh, I've seen something here. So, oh, we can't get it yet. We need more sticks. This smoke leaf, right? Yeah. All right, so that day we managed to research quite a few or observe a lot of new plant life. Veggie armor. Vanessa's having a meltdown, dude. We've got skin bark. Here we go. From this and twisted shapes, a big purple plant resembles alien fossilized trees. Upon analyzing it further, I found out that this bark was tough. Felt almost like a skin. I think the skin bark would be a fitting name for it. Beautiful. And we can use it for veggie leather. Done. So we're also going to have to come over here and harvest some of you. 
Just so we've got something to stock. Looks like we're gonna have to grab some hay. Alright, you'll see me back. After they sleep. Oh good, they've started doing weaponizing. Um what I might do is make another desk. Another research desk. And we'll make another copy of you. Silicon leaf, yes. Uh, obviously, this is a pointy red plant. Oh, we saw those before. Bulk core. Tins for size is an unlikely substance. It's silicon. Cool. Hen reached construction too. That's what we like. Now, if we go over here, we should now be storing some. S ah, there it is. So they only last for two days, under a roof, four days. So we don't want to cook too much, do we? We won't use it up, so let's come back here and only have two of each one, or three of each one. That allows, no, actually two is plenty. No, three. <laughs> Alright, cool, we'll keep that. Ready soups, that's our first one, construction two. We might have to move our fireplaces a little. How are we going with metal scrap? Let's... Oh, oh. That rain. Rain, I think, is coming. Thunderstorm. Oh, my goodness. Uh, have we already got everything from there? Okay. Oi! What happened? Someone got electrocuted? Damage campfire. That's alright, we can repair that later. Thunderstorms can kill. That's pretty much what that's telling us. Uh, so it can basically damage things and decrease happiness if they're outdoors. That makes sense. Cool, so we're building away here. Should be pretty happy with that food. And can we build out? Uh, there it is. Target practice. I love these. Let's just put you out here. Who knows where I'm actually just put out here. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's gone. We're going to lose it. We better repair it. Oh. <laughs> we can't repair it. Why not? I want to repair it. Destroyed campfire. Ah, oh, it's, it's destroyed. Okay. Ah, well. We'll copy you and build another one. But we'll build you out a bit further. We only need one, so why don't we just copy you in here and put up a torch. You can research and build lightning rods in order to protect your base from the lightning strikes. Okay, cool. That's a good idea. Let's uh, jump on our research tree. We've nearly done that. And we will now change that and that and that to that. And then we'll do that, that, and that. All right, you'll see me soon. Uh, we might do one more day and we'll leave it at that. No, thank you. We'll give feedback after I record. And we're back. We are back. Can we uh, mine a bit of this? Why not? We've been pumping away the food, researching away, building away. These guys are busy. 
We did need more scrap, so our closest ship to scrap is here. Quite a distance away. Buttermelons! Beautiful! Buttermelons! That was over here, so we'll go we'll go pick some of these buttermelons, so we've got some of those. Harvest and we'll harvest the buttermelons there. Oh I didn't see this. What's this? Rain grass. Oh peaceful? Peaceful. Oh that shouldn't take long to observe. Like you gotta observe the trees too. I know parasites causing fatigue and drugs for now. There is no cure, but skilled healer may be able to think of something. Well, we have a very skilled healer right over here. Specialist in healing. Antibiotics. That's what we'll have to research. PPU call. Oh yeah, so let's, uh, before we get to the end of the day here, end of this uh, episode, let's build another. I'm guessing we can make things faster by building another workbench. Hopefully we find some more survivors, but mainly another research bench. But it's sort of not worth it when they're not all working on it. Hmm. Need some more mushies. Oh! We can harvest you. And we can harvest you. And we can have butcher you. They get some meat. Beautiful. First lot of meat. Take it. Oh, there's some. There's right there. Scavenge right there. I didn't see that. Silicon. Cool. Alright, how's our uh, weapon research going? It's not. Everyone's too busy observing. Gotta stop doing that. Alright, so the end of the night. That is day six. Oh, aggressive animals are going to attack. <laughs> Practicing. That's cool. That's his entertainment. So we're going to get attacked by aggressive animals, so we'll wait for that, huh? So, the only problem is we haven't finished... Oh, we can, we can, no, we haven't finished our research of weapons. So that's going to be interesting. Destroyed shooting target. <laughs> Alright, we'll remove you and uh, we'll build another one. <laughs> they got their entertainment. Still build it, they're happy. Alright, see you back soon for the last day before we end at this episode. Oh. Well, those animals, are they attacking now? Oh, they are too. They're attacking now, guys. Alrighty. Uh, I don't think we've got anything other than these uh, guys with paws, paws, paws. We're going to have to wake these poor buggers up. Uh, who's got uh, the guns? You're awake. Alright, we're going to take... You're going to get up here. Wakey, wakey. Come up here. Alright, and who's got the other gun? 
No. Yes. Uh, and you're over there. Alright, wakey wakey. Yep. That's it. It's up to you guys. Here we go. Don't know how the traps are going to work. Can I just draft you guys? Well, draft, draft. Get over here. Yeah. Good. So far, so good. You guys can just attack. I think you can just fight it. Oh, dear. There you go. Go for him. <laughs> go, 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 go. Go. What about this guy behind you? Shoot this bad guy up here. Yeah. You got stuck in the trap. All right. That's that. Uh, undraft. You might have to go heal each other. Which, uh, which, oh, we can just actually do this. Uh, get rid of you guys. Nice, we survived. That's all that matters. Looks like we're going to have to put these... Go back to sleep. Oh, no, they're going to have to get healed, aren't they? Wait for treatment. Yep, been treated. Where's, um... Oh, Rita's over there. All right, well, that's that. We got the attack. We survived our first major attack. Uh, we've got two injuries, which we'll be able to deal with. And day seven is pretty much complete. Vanessa's doing her deed and doing some healing. Good job. Absolutely loving it already. It uh, is looking like a winner for me. Uh, and something I'm going to be playing right to the end. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Too close to comfort, hey? Yep. Too close to comfort. All right. We'll leave it there. Thanks, folks. Uh, so, yeah, that's... Uh, what we did we'll uh, get a nice uh, screenshot here won't we uh, thanks all and uh, like always I will see you all on the other side in this amazing beautiful uh, new survivalist 